influence of the business community. Yeah, big, a big difference. Uh, in 1964 and through the 1960s and yeah, the 70s, the ownership of important businesses was local and the people lived here. I'm talking about uh, you know, everyone remembers uh, Glenn Jackson, of course, the chairman of the Highway Commission, and chairman of Pacific Power, and all this sort of thing. But there were you know, every community seemed to have someone like that. Over in Primeville, it was Les Schwab. Uh, up in Beaverton and Portland, uh, it was Howard Vollum. And you just go right down the road, and it was a, a guy who owned a big timber company, or someone who had uh, in, in, in Salem, the role played by Jerry Frank was very important. These people all lived here, and their kids and their families were here, and you could go down the hall and talk to them. That, that was a big part of, of my interest in staying at the Oregon Statesman for 10 years, uh, was the fact that Charles Sprague, the uh, editor and publisher, lived here. He cared about it. He didn't have to send his profits off to Syracuse, <coughs> New York, or someplace. Um, and when he died in 1969, <coughs> I figured that that was probably going to be kind of the end of the statesman as I knew it. Someone they would sell it, and they did, and it was. Yeah, it made a huge difference. The corporate owners of uh, of Oregon businesses and industries, by and large, are not local people. There are exceptions, of course, like Phil Phil Knight and others you could name, but uh, it's changed, and it does make a difference. I know. When Portland was beginning to change and Neil Goldschmidt was trying to make the economic uh, uh, progress in Portland and he went to Nordstrom's and talked those people into, into changing. Well, they're, they're a Northwest family and uh, others uh, in Portland that bought into the idea of bringing in new industry uh, were people that had local roots and, and there are still some of those people up there, uh, the Columbia Sportswear people and others uh, in addition to, uh, to Nike. Yeah. Well, 